yeah, do you know what? It's something that, that yeah, that was a good shot. Take cover. Um, the, um, hold on. But before any of that, roll intro. <laughs> As you pass your bon journey, good afternoon. From the department says La Charente in the northernmost tip of the southwest of France. Yeah, quite a few of you liked yesterday's video where I visited the uh, the memorial. Um, yeah, I'm going to do a few more of them. Yeah, as well the, as well as other places. I just think it's really important that we don't we don't forget history, um, and we don't forget. The mistakes of history either. Anyway, today I've already been out, I've recorded it, um, but yeah, so we had to take the kids off to school and then um, we went to uh, Chopnier to go to a uh, a horse riding um, shop, <laughs> a tack shop I think they're called, um, and got Lisa some uh, protective gear stuff for the horse, brushes and stuff like that. And we're gonna go and see them this afternoon and talk to the lady that, uh, that is gonna gift them to us. Anyway, I'll show you what I did this morning and then I'm gonna make a curry. So let's do that. School run, then shop the A, get back here. Thank you slow mo. What are you I'm talking about is the ginger one. Whatever. <laughs>
hours ago. In that time, we've been back to the stables. We've uh, we've seen Wally the horse again. We've given him a brush and taken him for a walk. Uh, really, really bonded with him. And uh, yeah, it's more or less a done deal to, uh, to do some paperwork. Uh, the owner, um, he was, I think he was the first horse on, on the stables. But the owner, Vivi, uh, wants to come to our house. And well, we've invited her to our house so she can have a look at the setup and stuff like that. And then we'll take delivery of him. So we'll have to sort out some electric fencing down the bottom field. And that'll happen over the next couple of days. See you tomorrow. heard of the expression hidden in plain sight I'll show you that there is a stable we use it for the chickens behind me I don't normally film it from from the shop from this shot yes so it's where the chickens are and so the chickens are gonna move to that shed there. Now, when we bought the house, the owners already had two horses that lived in there. So uh, we're sorted for a stable. Knew a few people were concerned um, about the uh, about the lack of a stable. Uh, yeah, there is one. Um, sure, I can see a rat. And because. Um, we're pretty much integrated into the uh, into the riding school now. Um, we've made some lovely friends, so we've been uh, put in contact with people that can deliver us hay, um, a farrier um, that can do the um, the hooves. He's not uh, he's not shooed. Well, he's not shooed. Good morning. Um, and he had his worming treatment yesterday, which he needs uh, twice a year. So uh, and we saw that being done. Owning a horse is expensive and time consuming. Now, we've got the time. <laughs> so, um, yes, 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 there are no issues there. Um, yeah, expense. Um, yeah, do, do you know what? It's something that, that, yeah, that was a gunshot. Take cover. Um, the, um, hold on. I've come back indoors. Um, yeah, John Luke's with me. Um, he obviously knows I've been spooked. Uh, the cat's come over. <laughs> you know, puss. Um, which one are you? Oh, that's Dutch. Yeah, I'm uh, obviously, <laughs> um, yeah, the PTSD and stuff. It's um, not good with a gunfire. Anyway, what was I talking about? Yeah, you, Ulysses always wants to uh, own a horse and um, you only live once, don't you? You know, it's... Uh, so yeah, yes, that's what we're going to do, and uh, we're looking we're looking at, at getting him a friend too, um, Wally. So there's a, a, a possibility that we can uh, rehome one of those small horses. It's not a Shetland pony. At least keeps telling me the name, but I keep forgetting it. Uh, if I remember, I'll put it on the screen now. But anyway, what do you guys watch on telly? Uh, we've got Netflix. We've got Dodgy Box. Uh, we've got Amazon, uh, you know, so we can pretty much watch watch anything. Uh, what we're watching at the moment is uh, on Netflix. It's called Monsters. Um, so it's a, a true life adaptation of uh, I think it's the the Menendez brothers in the nineties who uh, shot and killed their parents in cold blood. But I think we're on episode eight, eight of nine. So that's coming to an end. Uh, we like true life stuff, true life crime. So uh, yeah, if you guys have got any suggestions. Um, Drop them in the uh, in the comments, and to give you an idea of the you, you, the taste of the stuff that we that we like, 
Lisa likes watching um, um, programs uh, from North Korea with the subtitles on. I don't. Um, you like Squid Game and stuff like that and uh, Alice in Borderland. Uh, what do I like? I like anything UFOs, conspiracy theories, um, true life, as I've said. But I like Game of the... The, the, the best thing that I've ever seen on telly, hands down, and I've watched it three times now, is Ozark with Jason Bateman in there. The, you know, the storyline is absolutely amazing. And, and it's about a, um, a family that have had to relocate to the Ozark part of America um, where, they've, where they have to launder money for the uh, Mexican cartel. And yeah, the, yeah, the storyline is absolutely amazing. Just waiting for the, uh, for the fourth season to come out. But it's, uh, yeah, the show is a gift that keeps on giving. So yeah, any suggestion, let us know in the comments, please. So today we're off to um, a place called Alu, which is uh, not too far from here. It's the uh, home address of Daryl and Liz, who we met through uh, YouTube, so that's amazing. Um, it's Daryl's birthday. I'm not sure whether it's his birthday today, but um, he's, he's looking good for 60. Yeah, that's all I'm going to say. Um, but, uh, yeah, uh, and Colin and Jane from French Countryside Life, link in the description, are also going to be there too. So Daryl's cooking um, a curry for us. So, uh, yeah, that'll be nice. And uh, we're, we are off later on, I think, are we off later on? To uh, Karina's house, to uh, the bottom field needs, um, sorting out in terms of uh, making it horse friendly, making it um, a way that it, the horse can't escape. So uh, some electric fencing down there. So that's what we're gonna be up to today. So I don't know whatever next is, whatever that is, let's do that. I thought I was going to get knocked over then. <laughs> so we've just come back from uh, from Liz and Daryl's. Uh, spend the afternoon with them and Colin and Jane. Had a lovely time. Uh, talking about favourite comedians like Ricky Gervais and uh, Alan. <laughs> what's his name? Jimmy. Hey, what's his name? Jimmy Jimmy Carr. It's obviously that favourite. Forgot his name. Anyway, so this weekend, um, probably going to be sorting out some fencing from the bottom field for the horse and, uh, and other stuff to do with the family. Players.